Hey everybody. Okay, so I'm having a lot of problems with the Maytek F405 AIO flight controller. Um, I have done BL Heli configurator on the ESCs, I'd reverse two motors, and I'm having really bad gyro problems. I'm pretty sure that's what it is. I've spent about two weeks trying to figure it out, spent a week building it. These are brand new two motor F30 BL Heli. Uh, ESCs, they're brand new F60 Pros, um, these have never been run. Uh, the flight controller's brand new, got off RC groups and someone, I really hope they didn't do the whole get a refund and then sell the old one type of deal that wasn't working but it didn't have any solder on it or anything, it looked new. Um, the problem I'm having is that when I arm it, it goes full throttle into the sky when you arm it for about a quarter second flies about 10 feet in the air and I have to disarm it immediately and then drops out. And it y'all spins to the left while it's doing that. So it rockets in the sky because of what I'm about to show you when I arm it. Um, I have to put the phone down to hold it so it doesn't go crazy and, and vibrate off the table. So give me two seconds. All right, this is while I'm holding it. I'm gonna loosen my grip. God. So you can hear it, the jello in it. Now I'm holding it tight and it's not doing it, but I'm gonna loosen my grip. And it will just do that until it goes full throttle. And this is without props. So I'm gonna disarm it really quick. Um, I have no idea. I'm running air mode, um, D-Shot 600 on the ESCs, I've tried multi-shot, I've tried one shot, I've tried one shot 25, I've tried D-Shot 300, um, I'm following all of the Oscar Liang, Oscar Lang sort of guides for these boards and what to do and other sort of YouTube videos and I have no idea. Um, if anybody's ever experienced this, I know they people talk about like mild twitches to the left. At this point, I would pray for that. That would be like a massive improvement. Um, at the moment, it's, it's just completely unflyable, as you can see. Because with props, it just it, it rockets into the sky and, and you all spin to the left. So I tried to get the lowest ESR possible with the factor cap. I have six other Panasonic caps that someone said don't even bother. Use the factory one, so that's what I did. It's on the correct battery lead. Um, I'm using a three cell right now just to keep it mild and keep it, you know, I have a feeling that four cell would be even worse. Um, I have no idea. I have a Foxier switcher. 600 225 milliwatt VTX and an Aero V2. Um, I have no idea if any of you guys have any suggestions. I can't tell you how much I appreciate it. I, at this point, I'm willing to mail it to someone who knows what they're doing. This is only my second build, but I've never had problems like this. Um, so if anybody has any suggestions, that would be incredible because this, I'll just arm it like it is. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, it's not working. Um, so any help? Oh my God, be massive, massive thank you to you. So thank you guys. And I really hope I don't have to rip out and throw away this board that I bought for $40. Thank you.